Well, happy Wednesday. Hope you're having a good day, halfway through the week. I hope you're not worried or anxious about anything, but if you are, we're praying against that, and we're not gonna let worry and anxiety steal our joy. We're not gonna let it steal the joy in our hearts that comes from being connected to God's Holy Spirit. And so we're gonna connect God's Spirit by connecting to God's Word. It's just the last verse summing up the wedding at Cana. John chapter 2, verse 11. Jesus did this as the beginning of his signs in Cana in Galilee, and so revealed his glory and his disciples began to believe in him. So Jesus performs this miracle of turning water into wine, and not just a little bit of wine, but a huge amount, and not just wine that's okay to the taste buds, but the best, choicest wine. And as a result, his disciples began to believe in him. Huge antidote for us of worry and anxiety is faith, is trust. It's believing in the God of miracles, believing in in the Son of Man, the Son of God who can do anything and everything in our lives. That as we place our faith and trust in Him, our anxiety and our worries go down. You know, it's, it's been said this, stop telling your problem, you know, telling God how big your problems are and start telling your problems how big your God is. That your God can do anything, that your Savior can do anything. So let's pray for for faith and trust and belief in our Savior and how big He is and how gracious He is. Heavenly Father, we thank You for this passage from John. We thank You for this verse. And we, we pray that You would build our trust, build our faith in Your Son, that He is bigger than any of our problems, that Jesus is greater. And that we pray, too, that we would, uh, again, be connected to that generosity of your Son, that he wants not just solve our problems, but overwhelm them with his goodness. We pray this through Christ our Lord. Amen.